Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the new spell power rune for your mage in phase two of Season of Discovery. Now, this is a very useful rune to get. This one is going to give you guys a 50% increase to your critical strike damage of all of your spells. So yeah, a rune you definitely wanna get. Now, in order to get this rune, you need to collect 20 mage books scattered across the entire world of Azeroth. And this one is kind of a continuation of the Icy Veins rune. And that one was the one that required 10 books to collect. So in this video, I'm going to already assume that you have those first 10 books collected and you have the icy veins rune and real quick if you guys haven't collected any of the books before there are a ton of guides out there that show you the locations for the first 10 books and at the time of recording this video there has only been eight locations for phase two books that have been discovered so what that means is you're going to have to go back and collect some extra books from phase one so what this basically means is that if you're an alliance player like me you're gonna have to go to a couple of locations for horde books and it's going to be a little tricky. I think for me personally, the hardest book that I found was the one inside Ogremar. I had to basically corpse run a bunch of times to finally get it, but it's definitely doable. So what I'm kind of alluding at here is you want to have at least collected and turned in 12 books before you even attempt the ones that are going to be in this video. So here is the first book location we're going to go after. This one is located in Duswalla Marsh at this location here. It's actually inside a camp of murlocs, so you definitely need to fight your way through them to get to the book. I was a little low level here, so I basically teamed up with another player and he helped me clear it out. This next book is going to be located in Desolus, and this is going to be in the Thunderaxe Fortress. It's going to be in the big giant building in this location. You're just going to have to fight your way in and go to the center of the room, and it's going to be on this table here. The next book location is going to be located in the Thousand Needles. This one is going to be on the really high mesa with all of the Grim Totems that camp way up on the cliff. Basically, you're just going to have to fight your way up there, and it's going to be located in the very far back tent to the left. This next spot is going to be in Arathi Highlands on the Eastern Kingdoms. We're going to be going over to the Witherbark Village, and then on the far right side along the mountains, there is a small hut. And this is where we're going to find this next one. Moving on to the Altrek Mountains, the next book we're going to be going after will be located here on the map, and it's going to be inside this ruined tower. For this next book, we're going to be going to Stranglethorn Vale, located right here. And in my opinion, this is probably the hardest one to do by yourself if you're under level. I did this at level 34, so I could not kill any of the mobs in this area. So basically your options are either get someone to help you in this area or do what I did here, which is basically waiting for the Basilisk here to kind of pat far enough away to let me, you know, release and then actually loot this thing without him coming and getting me. But I would say just try to bring a friend or someone in the area to help you out because yeah, this one took me so long, it was really annoying. The next book we're going after is going to be located here in the Swamp of Sorrows. This location is actually going to require a rusted key to basically unlock the cage that the book is inside. You can get the rusted cage key from the lost ones in the area, or if someone else already has the key in the area, they can just open the cage up for the both of you and you can loot it that way. For our last book, we're heading over to the Badlands, and this one is going to be actually located at the top of a mountain inside a tomb. Now, I did forget to actually record while I looted that, but it's going to be on the ground right here. So now that you have these books, just take them back to the NPC in the Mage Quarter in Stormwind and get the rune. So yeah, that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this one, please do me a favor and leave a like on this video as well as subscribe to the channel. Apparently doing these two things is going to really just boost my channel and YouTube loves it, so I would really appreciate it. So yeah, thanks again for watching. I'm still solo and I'll see you guys in the next one.